You guys ready? So welcome to XPT, Exploration Breathing. We're gonna do a little breath work here for about 30 minutes. So take you on a little journey. So first I want you to lay back on your back, knees in the air, slowly breathe in through your nose. So draw the air in through your nose and fully expand until you have all the air in through, in, in through your nose and that you can hold and then slowly exhale through your nose. Now what I want you to do right now in the beginning of this is to visualize a balloon. And as you begin to breathe in through your nose, the balloon fills up and eventually the air goes into the legs, into the feet, in the toes, into the arms, into the fingers and the hands. And then when we exhale, the limbs collapse, the belly collapse, the chest collapse. So in through the nose, keep drawing, keep drawing, keep drawing all the way into full saturation, then slowly out through the nose and collapse. In through the nose, out through the nose, all the way in, all the way out. Again, visualize the body fully expanding, the hands, the feet, the face, the head, the ears. Everything fills up with air on the inhale and then everything collapses on the exhale. All the way out till there's none left on the exhale. The balloon is shriveled up. Your body's shriveled up and then we, again, drawing the air in through the nose. All the way in, keep going all the way in. Tighten that balloon, make it as big as it can be. Get as much as you can in. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Fill, I want you to hold right now. I want you to hold. The balloon is full and you're holding all of that fullness. And you can feel the air, like I said, in your feet, in your hands in your fingers, in your toes, in your ears. And then we slowly let the air out again, all the way out, all the way till the balloon has no air left, all the way down, all the way out and now we're holding. Now we're holding with no air and the urgency to breathe will climb quickly in through the nose, out through the mouth. In through the nose, all the way in. Again, filling up all the way, out through the mouth. Now let's begin to create a pattern here, in through the nose, out through the mouth. Keep it up. Draw the air in through the nose, into the stomach, out through the mouth. Keep it up. Nice rhythm. Keep up that rhythm, in through the nose, out through the mouth. Nice rhythm, nice pace.
Three, two, one. Draw the air in through the nose, all the way in. Let it out through the mouth. <sighs> Collapse the balloon all the way down. One more, in through the nose, all the way in. Fully expand, expand the stomach. Again, into the feet, into the hands, into the ears. All the way in. Exhale through the mouth, all the way out. One more. In through the nose. Into the stomach. Into the chest. Then fill the legs. Fill the arms. Fill the feet. Fill the hands. Fill the head. Exhale through the mouth, all the way out. All the way. And hold. We are now holding on the exhale. We're holding on the exhale. You can swallow to suppress your urge to breathe. So if, if you have an urgency to breathe, when holding on the exhale, you can swallow. We are holding on the exhale. Slowly begin to draw the air in through the nose. Until full and hold. You can straighten your legs if you want, still holding. Slowly let the air out. Slowly let the air out. And hold. Slowly draw the air in through the nose. Keep drawing. Keep drawing. And hold. Begin breathing in and out of your nose. Think about pumping up a bicycle tire. In and out of the nose only. It's like you're pumping up a tire. This is an opportunity for you to reload your system. The stomach drives the air, the diaphragm drives the air, so the air gets pulled through the nose because the diaphragm is expanding, the air gets pushed out because it's contracting. The diaphragm is driving the air in and out of the nose, nice rhythm.
slowly begin to increase the pace. Slowly increase the pace. I want you to begin to increase the pace as quick as you can, but yet still engaging the diaphragm. So speed, speed, nose, breath, in, case, in and out of the diaphragm. If you ever seen a dog smell something, I call it the doggy breath. In and out of the nose as quick as you can, as fast as you can. Almost like a hyperventilation, but only nose. Hard to sustain, but keep it up. Keep it up, quick as you can, in and out of the nose. Keep going. Keep it up, quick as you can. Stop. Slowly draw the air in through the nose, all the way in. All the way, all the way, all the way. All the way. Grating your teeth slowly, let the air out of your mouth through your teeth as slow as you can. I want you to extend your breath, exhale as long as you possibly can. The best way to do that is gritting your teeth, letting the air out through, the, through your mouth, through your teeth. Extend that exhale as long as you can. Slowly draw the air in through the nose again. Slowly draw it in, draw it in, draw it in. Full expansion into the legs, into the arms, into the body, filling up. And hold. Again, gritting the teeth, slowly letting the air out of the mouth. Begin to slowly let the air out and extend this breath as long as you can. Extend. Now I want you to push little bits of air out, any that are left anywhere in the lung, any last little remaining bits of air that are anywhere in your lung, push it out of your mouth. Push it out, get rid of it. Dig down deep, find some air in there and push it out. In through your nose. Out through your mouth. In through your nose. Out through your mouth. Nice pattern. Here we go. In nose, out mouth. Nice rhythm. Here we go. Now I want you to go to a double inhale, single exhale. In through the nose, twice, out through the mouth once. So in through the nose, twice, out through the mouth once. In through the nose, twice, out through the mouth. On the first inhale through the nose, into the stomach, second inhale into the chest. Double nose, single mouth. Keep it up. Double nose, single mouth. Keep it up, nice rhythm.
three, two, one, all the way in, all the way out. And hold. Holding on the exhale. Swallowing will suppress your urge to breathe. Let a very little bit in your nose. Very, very small amount. Just a teeny bit of air in. Let a little more air in. Let a little more air in. Let it all come in. Exhale through the mouth. And hold. In through the nose. And hold. Exhale through the mouth. Here we go, in through the nose, out through the mouth. Now, single nose, double mouth. Keep it up, keep it up. Single nose, double mouth. Keep it up. Single nose, double mouth. Slow it way down. Here we go. Slow it way down. In. One, two, three, four, five, six. Out. One, two. Three, four, five, six. In. One, two, three, four, five, six. Out. One, two, three, four, five, six. In. One, two, three, four, five, six. Out. One, two, three, four. 4, 
five, six, all the way in. One, two, three, four, five, six, out. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now slowly draw the air in. Don't allow there to be any pressure though. Bring the air in and hold. We're holding now on the inhale. Relax your jaw, your feet, your hands, any tension anywhere. Relax your system. Melt into the floor. We're holding on an inhale. You have more than enough oxygen to be here. We are holding. If we're not holding, you can begin to breathe through your nose, but if you're holding, hold. If you're breathing through your nose, I want you to detach from your breath. Don't participate, just let your body take over your autonomic system, your automatic reflex. No matter where you are, Begin to breathe through your nose very slowly, effortlessly, completely detach from your breath. Your only participation will be to create a space between the inhale and the exhale. So now we're gonna create a space between the inhale and the exhale, but the initiation of the breath should only be done by itself. The breath should only be done by itself. The breath will automatically take over and breathe at its own pace, its own timing. Just your only participation is a little space between the in and the out. Just a little gap between those breaths. Just a, a moment between the heartbeat. A moment between, between the breath. But the breath has its own mind.
when you're ready, you can slowly come to and roll over. Okay, you can sit up whenever you're ready. Slowly, slowly breathe in and out of your nose and your stomach from the seated position. Work on your, work on driving your diaphragm against your spine. Think about your stomach and your spine and the relationship to your breath. Think about as you breathe in, that you expand on your sides and your front and your back. So as you breathe in through your nose, you feel expansion in all four directions. Down into your groin. And then as you exhale, you feel everything come in, the sides, the front, and the back. Now we'll do one last little thing just to kind of rev us back up. We're going to work on, I call it the Indonesian monkey chant, but we're going to work on a little exhale. So we're just going to make a sound with our exhale and it's going to be a little bit like ha, 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 ha. So here we go. One, two, three. Ha, Think about as you breathe in, you breathe the world in, all the world's in, and then as you breathe out, all the world's out. <sighs> Draw the air in through the nose. <coughs> nose only. I think that should more than suffice. <laughs>